Hello, everybody, and... Oh! Oh, boy, all the salts is coming back in. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, bird. I'm sorry. Oh, no. But, hello, everybody, and welcome back to... Welcome back to me accidentally hitting the trigger when I pick up the trick When I pick up the controller, because I'm not used to how sensitive the PlayStation's triggers are. Holy shit. Welcome back to Bloodburn, with the adventures of Window Man. Um... I... Died in here, didn't I? I feel like I got some souls to grab. Yeah. Oh boy, so hey. Were you guys fooling before? Was that boss supposed to actually be really easy? Oh, fucking. Because, I mean, like, I killed, like, the, the one reborn, which looked fairly difficult. Alright, Mifa, good night. Uh, the one reborn looked fairly difficult, but it died in like, what, like three, three attempts, recon not, recon not included. Where does this go? But then like that thing took, that, 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 that fucking uh, celestial emissary took whatever. So I wanted to let it be. So, so I did basically, I fucked up. I allowed a easy boss to shit on me. And this looks like the place with another boss. And I'm really glad I don't have enough souls to level up. Is that another Cthulhu? It's Damien! Hey, buddy! Uh, 80% of people say this emissary fight is piss easy. Well, how does, um... How does, uh, fucking, uh, One Reborn factor into that? Like, is he easier or harder, according to people? Altar of this fucking Christ, that's a name. That's a name. Oh, jeez. Oh, and, um, also, I'm just gonna say this straight up. I'm probably not gonna be able to go three hours tonight. I've got some, I got some stuff to do. Um, so I'm probably gonna go for, like, uh, two and a half hours. I might go for three. Depends when my food gets here. But I got a food delivery, don't know. Um, is this a Cthulhu? Like, do, do I stab it? Man. Yeah, that looks like a thing I'm supposed to stab. Ebriatus, daughter of the co- I did no damage. Okay, and it's got a big old mouth vagina. All right. Seems like a job for a good old whip cane, but I don't want to get near that. Oh, oh no, I'm the, the amount of damage I'm doing is negligible. Okay, and that didn't work. So I feel like this is gonna work like, uh, fuck! Work like am amygdala, right? So I'm gonna hit it in the face. Say hello to one of the hardest bosses in the game. Oh, good! With the amount of damage I was doing to it. Oh, no. I checked the wiki of Reptalia. I did, yeah, but I skimmed it. Like, I didn't read any details, I mostly just checked the images. And a little bit of, like, what stuff that was told to us in the episode, anyway. Yeah, it's so basically, like, when, I, when I, I clicked on the wiki, I looked at the things, and I read, like, the thing was like, Hey, she's a raccoon girl who fucking got shit on really bad. Fucking But hey, hooray for hooray for raccoon girl. She's trying her best. Are they trying to fight me? They are trying to fight me. Alright, let's uh let's get Damien's help. I mean, so he 
he's the he's one of the boys who like I touched the body and I went into fucking level two of the of the nightmare, right? Of the lecture building. Oh god. Oh wait, I was gonna say he's doing nothing, but no, he is actually doing stuff. Damien, hit it, shoot it in the face. Hey, there you go, buddy. Wait, do this thing not hit behind it? Oh my god, if I get stuck in his butt, it can't do anything. Yes! I love you, Exploit Chan. Oh, fuck. Exploit Chan, I can't believe you betrayed me. Wait, did he just heal me? Damien has a healing spell. I just, I, the second I pressed triangle, I was like, wait, why am I not low health? Damien has a healing spell. Damn it, Damien. Whoa! Fucking Christ! Alright, okay. Under understandable there, fucking Nebriatus. What? Set. Why would I do that? <laughs> Why would I do that when I am the world's greatest hunter who dies to the easiest boss? Yeah. <laughs> I. Oh my god, I didn't pick up my echoes. I could have died and just lost the emissary's echoes right there. Oh, that's bad mouthfeel right there. Nothing. Um. Wait, is that is that Rom? Is that Rom's head? I wonder if I can guess something here. Make contact. Hang on, let me. I think I think it's mostly the fact that I've got like really high blood tinge and this bow. <laughs> I think that's it, because li literally I was just, I was throwing away, I was throwing away my health, and so like basically like one blood vial worth of health to get five free bullets and just laying into it whenever it was far away. So I mean, basically I'm just using a mechanic that was never intended to be used, because I don't think the game was ever made with it, you having a really good ranged weapon in mind. <laughs> What Sorry. is very well? Let me... Let's um. 
Let's get some, let's get some blood tunes. And how are we looking as far as equipment goes? We need, we, okay, we need some, we need some bullets for sure. And we need some blood vials. As for level ups. Hey, I can make the bow blade better. Do that. And uh, now I need blood rock. Basically, I'm up with titanite slabs now. Alright. Nazi, good at the video game. What was that fucking, like... What was that tweet I put out, like, 30 minutes ago? Hey, hey, watch me fucking, like, stomp, stomp the fucking hardest bosses in the game. And just, and get fucking stomped by the easiest ones. <laughs> was only higher level, there's a reason they use the cannon for Bloodborne's god mode video. Alright. But you don't need the cannon when you've got the bow. Like, the bow is a, is a weapon that scales with skill and blood damage. So it's like... Fuck, just no, get them, just get them both, get both, get both those up. And go. So where does the arrow come from? Does he, do you just have the arrow in your pocket? Do you just have the arrow in your pocket? Like, what if you have like a frame by frame of this thing transforming so I can see what, what's up with it? Cannon does like 800 damage a shot. Fuck me. All right. Oh, not there. Uh, not there. Not there. Okay, what the fuck? Really weird that that's on the first tombstone. Oh yeah, no, the blood, blood, the bow blade, the bow blade. I feel like I feel like if I didn't have the DLC and I was going, th I, I would still be using the cane. I would still be using the cane if not if not for the DLC, and I probably would be having a lot less fun because other than the cane, the only other gun I have any uh, other gun, the only other um, weapon I've got interest in is probably the. Um, The, uh, the, the, the gun, the gun rapier. But even then, I've, like, since there's no, since there's no weapon, like, gun I could replace it with in my left hand, like, it's just, like, oh, no, I have two guns. Am I doing it right? Is this the thing I'm supposed to do? Like, like, you said to make contact. Or did you mean something else? I'm probably standing in the wrong place. Am I? Make contact in front of the face until contact is made. Oh boy! So how's everyone doing? Welcome, welcome back to like Waitborn. Imagine if in Dark Souls you had to do this. You had to you had to do pray like you had to do praise the sun in front of something for like fucking hours on end. No, I'm gonna lie. I've spent most of today. Like, I should have recorded No Game No Life, but I'm, I'll do that after the stream. But I've been trying to like uh, write a short story, like a thousand word short story, um, and I just can't. I've restarted it like six times, and I can't. I can't figure out what I want to do with it. So I keep just hitting a point where I'm just like, no, I won't get it done in time. But I got this really nasty habit when I'm writing stuff. That I just like, I want to get into detail. And I want to like fucking go in and be like, okay, here's what's happening, and like give you this, give the reader this big fucking thing. And like, just like, hey, here's everything that's going on. Like, fucking, like, look at all this cool shit that's happening. I am in front of it. Thank you for the uh, host, Hofshi. Could 
to mean like here? Fine, there you go. There, we're in front of the face. Um Thank thank you, my dude. Um but yeah, just Oh boy, like Thank you. Yeah, like it, it's really difficult writing fiction without going overboard and trying to like get like as much going as well. Cause like when I read fiction, like if I don't get like a really, really good idea of what's going on, I get really annoyed slash bored, and I don't have any really immersion. But, so, like, when I write fiction, it's always, like, it's not, I'm not quite fucking, um, George R.R. R. Martin, where, like, you know, he'll describe every fucking vein on the fucking Lannister penis. But, like, I, I still, like, I wanna, I wanna give, make sure the reader has all the information they need and then some to describe what's going on. I do like, I do like how the, she changes arms. That's, that's actually a really cool detail. Annex, are you sure this is... Yeah. Are you sure, like, are you sure I don't, I don't need something first? Like, a certain amount of insight or something? Maybe I didn't get the... Yeah, maybe there's a requirement for it? I don't know. But... but... Okay, so where do I go now? I just go back to the lecture building? The, oh, sorry, the Nightmare of Mensis. Nightmare of Mensis. Oh, shit. I imagine this is where I'm gonna meet Damien for real, and I wonder if he's going to remember me at all. Oh, wait, this is the place with the, with the scary type. I just realized this rock is a face. Was, was it like this in the other nightmare? Where all the rocks were faces? Oh, no. I've got to fight that guy. Wait, he's getting frenzied too. What? Oh my god. I... I have several questions. <laughs> yeah, oh boy, okay, so we gotta get past... We gotta deal with being glared at by an angry castle. These guys who can hit me through walls. I don't know how to deal with this. They take French damage. But I can't, like, there's no, the cover's not big enough to fight them. Because they'll just spit out the carrion worms. Oh boy, it's almost as if it's a nightmare. Oh, jeez. Okay, so bow blade's still gonna be the best bet, I think. Fucking I didn't even have a chance on that. I didn't even have a chance on that. Jesus. Bunch of blood cocktails. Do I even have any of those?
Oh, man. I, I had, when did I get nine of those? All right. Um... Still going up. I'm going to die. Yep. All right. Hmm. So, so I need to stop every now and then to. Then about to. Oh wait. You know what I forgot I had? You know what I forgot I fucking had? Graham Graham's Flintstones Chewable Morphine. Thank you, Graham Graham. Okay, now where am I at? Oh, the guy's here. So, all I gotta make sure I do is... Oh, one. See if I can make that guy die from it. Because if he's just gonna be walking around, he might just die. Because he's gonna patrol, right? No, he is not gonna patrol. Fucking. Followed me off. <laughs> he followed me off. Uh... All right, all right. I think I know how to do it now. Fucking... Even if I do spend it, I'm still gonna get frenzy and I'm still gonna deal with these assholes. So... God, why is it so hard to run from them this time? He's got my echoes, but that's fine. I don't have to stop to grab anything this time, so I can just push. Yeah. Just slurp down the morphine. Alright, now we're safe. Just keep on running. Okay, and I see a door, which means I should be fine. And I'm pretty sure one of them just got killed by Frenzy. Yep! Can't, can't hit me if I'm opening a door. Okay. Oh, so that's just for the... First part. Nope. That's big old negative, Ghost Rider. I really didn't want to deal with Patch's family. Oh fuck! The babies are small enough to get in. Oh, but they ain't shit. Oh, she can reach. Not very far, but she can reach. Alright, okay, 
right, now I know what you can do. Okay, she can't hit me. I'm over here, she can't hit me. Come on, Mama Spider. Come on. Hooray for Exploit Chan. Uh, we're in the Mensis Nightmare, fighting a big old spider mom. Oh, I love you, Exploit Chan. And now I've got to fight all the babies. Oh, here they come. Fuck. God, they do so much damage. But they don't seem to want to move much. This shitty air. Oh no. Well, I just, I just two shot um, a Briatus, so you know. Time for some pride. Time for some falling to come with this, to come with this fucking pride. Uh, okay, and we got a big thing over there. All right, what's this? Spiders? No, no spider. Shaman Bone Blade. The fuck is that? Is that a throwable? It looked like a throwable. Slash foes to make them lose their- what? A blade of bone coated with a gruesome spinal fluid, used by old labyrinth watchers, in particular those presiding over rituals. When a victim is cut by this blade, this green spinal fluid temporarily numbs the senses, serving the target's gross motor skills. The blade, never intended for battle, must cut deep to be effective, and breaks. Uh, I just killed Ibriatus. Those are great against Rom. Oh, so... Basically, I've got them right about when they're useless, then. Oh, that's great. I used up so many... Oh, fuck! Used up so many blood vials. Back, you vile demons! <laughs> Seems like I'm just gonna keep using a couple of vials. Oh god, maybe I should have bought some of those at the store. Dead man's knowledge? I got plenty. I'm getting tons of inside stuff. Which is concerning me, because we're in a lot of frenzy areas. Why is this not an illusory wall? This looks like an illusory wall. Why is this bridge here? It goes nowhere. That bridge goes nowhere. Why is that not an illusionary wall? But, alright. Uh, is that... Is that Damien? Oh no, he doesn't have a cadence. So he's just wearing a student uniform. Hey, bud. You want to try this shit again? There we go. I didn't know what the t I still don't know what the timing is on the fucking short sword and stuff. It's so quick. Oh shit, fuck. Oh hey, I can counter that fairly easily, come on. Ow. Oh, 
thought it was Damien because he was wearing a thing. I, I thought he had a cage on his head, but no, he just had the big thing coming up him. Crown of Illusion? What about the Crown of Illusion? Like, I, I thought, um... I mean, I, I I like to think I'm pretty good, but then I got shit on by a boss, everyone was like, Oh yeah, no, you'll be able to get this boss in one go. Yeah, no, it's fine. Celestial Emissary's a bitch, and it takes me, like, well, like, five attempts. Uh... That, that, that was the bad feeling. Hey, there's a chest. Yellow back. Alright, you know what? I'm curious now. Let's go back and put the crown on C. Because I thought that crown would only work on um, stuff in uh, Kanehurst. But we're in a dream right now, aren't we? This cute little crown. Look at this fucking thing. It's so tiny. It doesn't fit on my head right. I'm a pretty princess. Alright, now I really want to find a lamp in here because... Oh boy, my bullet and blood totals are not looking great. Yeah, no. Not real. Like, okay, so, I straight up, like, you guys are my, like, fake grand order, right? I don't understand why people enjoy that, because all I can tell is just a basic gotcha game, you know? It's a basic gotcha game with butchered historical figures from a series that was based around a porn doujin. Right? Like... What the fuck? blood vial. I don't know what this guy's deal is, but if he's got a weird mask on, and that, I don't want to deal with that right now. Then there's free souls. I should clean is better. I think the only, like, gotcha-style game I've actually, like, enjoyed is Girls Frontline. But the, but the file sizes in that fucking game are so fucking bad that the only th thing I could actually you play that game on was my fucking Windows tablet. And even then I had to do it through a fucking Android emulator, so it just didn't work right. So it was just a matter of, like, oh god, that, ooh, ooh, that is not a great camera. Right there. What the fuck? Yeah, like, Gun, uh, Girls Frontline, I think, is the only one I've actually enjoyed, but if they could make a version of that game that doesn't eat up, like, fucking, like, half your fucking phone's hard drive, or whatever the fuck's in a phone, like, I would, I would appreciate that. Because I really want to like that game, and I really want to play it, because it's actually fairly interesting. But, mmm, is it, is it, does it take, just take up some fucking space? It's almost like you need a fucking SD card just for that game. And they have the fucking, like, the cheek to go, Hey, do you want an even more, an even better fucking uh, girl's frontline experience? You can download high-definition voice packs and shit. And, and, like, better art and all that, and turn that on in the fucking settings. And I'm just like, you fucking what? Like... You're already using up a ridiculous amount of space! Worth it. Alright, 
Bella. See you later. Oh, jeez. So I'm gonna try my best to not use up all my blood files in one go, but let's see what's down here. I'm not too worried about the echoes. Like, I'll pick them up if I see them. Yeah, no, that guy has them. I don't even fight them right now. Let's see what's over here. This way. Is this a is this a new area? Oh yeah, no, this is the first lamp. Nah, that's fine. I literally lost nothing. I remember Kara no Kyokai guarding the Sinner's face. Oh well. The thing is, though, I don't enjoy Fate's universe. That's the thing. I, I don't, like... Hey, we made... We made, uh... We made King Arthur a girl. Hey, we made fucking, um... We made fucking Jack the Ripper a lolly. We fucking... Uh... Did all this other shit that's really dumb. And I'm, and I'm just like, alright, me for you. Keep that shit away from me. So, okay, so these guys just wander around pretty peacefully. There was like a jump back around here. So, like, are some of these guys crazy and... Beast blood pellet. Yeah, these guys just kind of wander around aimlessly. Like, what's their deal? He's got these weird helmets on. That are way too big... Oh, these are... Oh, these are knights! They're, like, wearing chain... I, they're wearing chain mail and fucking tabards. What the fuck is the deal with these guys then? Like, are they like... So before... <laughs> oh, jeez, but um... So, like, before they used hunters, they used knights, right? So, are these guys the guys that were left over? Like, basically, like, people who... Knights that they sent off to go fight the beasts? They got fucking ripped to shit? And they just, they're just cursed to wander this fucking nightmare for all eternity? Is that what's going on here? Like, is that what's happening? Oh, you're a large boy. Are you friendly? No, you're not friendly! You are the opposite of friends. Oh, and attacking that person makes them all get violent. Hey, you did the thing! He did the thing that everyone in Dark Souls does when they have a cleaver. Alright, so yeah, you're supposed to kill these guys before engaging that big man. Otherwise they all aggro. That's a neat gimmick. They just wander around aimlessly until the big daddy gets, gets upset. Man's knowledge. That that is that is an interesting gimmick. Is he gonna try and fight me again? No. Okay. Big Daddy is dead, so they don't care anymore. Okay. Good to hear it, friends. I would hate to have to stomp your dicks off. Oh, and there's more of them. Okay. This could go badly. Oh, wait, so, okay, the ones in Radius are upset. Alright, so I just gotta keep an eye out. That one's got a crossbow! Fucking go back to Dark Souls, you coward! Use guns now! Yeah, these guys are definitely from a different time period, because they're using, like, fucking crossbows and shit. Fuck! Alright, he's got a chain. Alright, we need to 
to fucking... Please don't look... Please stop looking onto him! Oh. I was... You guys saw that camera freaking out, right? I was trying to, like, flick the stick to lock onto the fucking crossbowman. And it just kept snapping back to the guy with the axe. What the fuck is that? They some bullshit, I tell you what. I mean, it shouldn't be. I mean, if I'm flicking the stick and moving it, and the camera is moving, then it should stay moved afterwards, you know? Like, that's a little silly at that, at that point. I gotta say, this is like the, the one, like, Soulsborne title that I've had issues with, um the camera so much. It was Celestial Emissary, how it was constantly trying to aim the camera at the floor when he went big. So it was really hard to see what he was doing. Alright, buddy, come on. Okay, he shouldn't have any guys come to help him now. Oh, fuck's sake, come on! How would- how did that not- Oh god, sometimes the parry timings in this game, like, really just don't make any sense. Alright, you are a bitch. So, crossbowman. Really, dude? That's all I got for that. That's just... That's just annoying. That's just annoying. And I can't even, like, use the whip to fucking, like, line of sight fuck them. Ugh. That's just an annoying encounter right there. That's all that is. That's just like, hey, dum-dum. Here's three guys with crossbows and one guy who's gonna hit you really hard with an axe. And all three of them will put poison on you a little bit. Have fun. And also, if you leave any of the little slaves alive, the big guy will turn them on, so you have to deal with those too. It's just kind of like a, just an, an annoying encounter. Like, not challenging, not difficult. Just annoying. But if they're just gonna fucking light me up with a crossbow, what do I do? Especially because when they, with the, when the chain man... Hmm. Neat. Uh, when the chain man aggros, all of the little babies aggro too. So you gotta kill the little babies for engaging the chain man. Otherwise, like, otherwise you gotta deal with them, but... Let me get the... fuck's sake. Look at my damage he can do. And he just fucking head slipped that. 
Like, the amount of damage he can do is ridiculous. And add in fucking guys with the crossbows. I, I can actually just get killed in, like, one frame. Oh, boy. This is... Like, these nightmare zones really do feel like it's the part where Miyazaki goes, Okay, so can I can I make a no fun zone now? Like the guy the, the guy who's like giving him his anti-psychotic meds. Like he's like, okay Miyazaki, you've made a very nice level that's nice and fair and balanced. Okay, now you can make a level that's that's pants shittingly difficult. And then we're gonna have some of some of those happy pills you like so much, yeah? Those pills that stop you from cutting the heads off kittens in the office? Because we don't want to see the nice lady from HR again, do we, Mr. Miyazaki? Seriously, like, if that guy's not on anti-psychotic medication, I will be surprised. I've been doing pl I've been doing pretty fine, like, so far in the game, dude. And then I hit here, and it's just like, hey, parry timing, parry timing plus really annoying hitboxes. Also, they'll sh hit you, they'll kill you in one hit, and if they don't, they'll give you poison. Like, that's kind of a big jump. these guys by their by themselves. Yeah. If it was just these guys by themselves, it wouldn't be that big of an issue, but like I said, we've got to deal with the crossbow guys too. And they are a problem. Because if I get hit by that guy, then he's got me, but but if he doesn't hit me and I just am getting needled by crossbow bolts that have poison on them, as another issue. Or pebble a bit. He'll just aggro these guys. So I can kill this one. Now, what I can try and do is. Try and get this guy over here, and then book it to the crossbow guy, and the chain. Fucking! Alright, so now I should be able to take care of you. Time to press try and fuck. This again. Oh. 
like, they can soak up so much damage that, like, a parry is, like, the quickest way to solve the issue. <sighs> Doing that is really hit or miss. It's like, sometimes I'll just, I'll expect them to approach, and I'll fire to expect their approach, but they'll just do the dumb thing, like, swing in place. Okay. Boo! Boo, Mateo! Boo! If I can get the backstab on this guy again... Ah, oh, fuck me! ARE YOU FUCKING KIDDING ME?! I got hit by the fucking air coming off that! He fucking hit my big toe with that, for fuck's sake. my fucking big toe with that. You, come on. Hey, that this guy finally started using his chain. Alright, now can I just please get past this room? ARE YOU KIDDING ME?! WHY DID HE TURN AROUND?! WHY DID HE TURN AROUND?! Get past this hallway. But the first attack, but the first attack doesn't do visceral damage. The second one that does it. That's if he gets hit by the first one, he'll turn around. I just want to get past this hallway, man. Like we, like seriously, we did so good. We fought like one of like apparently one of the hardest bosses in the game. Beat him two tries. And now it's just like, no, you can't get past this hallway. Go fuck yourself. No, no, you don't. You don't need to hit the one. Watch, I'll show you. I'll show you on these guys, look. So I'm gonna purposely miss on the first one. See? Only the second one hit, and he still got hit by it. You only need the second one. The first one, the first one. Someone who's just like an enemy that's quick enough can turn around. You fucking kidding me? Why didn't that stun? Okay, you know what? I don't care anymore. Fuck you. Fuck all of you. Fuck this nightmare. Fuck the people dreaming it. Fuck Miyazaki. Fuck them.
I slid off the corner. I slid off the corner. I'm glad someone is. No, it looked like on my thing, it looked like there was a tile there, and I just fucking slid off. To me, that looked like there was a tile there, and I stepped on the tile and I just slid off the side. That's what that looked like to me. It's very foggy. Fuck you! Fuck you! I missed a- I missed an item. Missed an item. Go back down and get that. That was totally worth- that was- sorry, no, that was- that was the most worth it. Fucking fall down that hole. Fall down it. Where's this go? Where's where's this go? Um... Oh, for fuck's sake, birds! Okay, so I've got to fight a new. These are birds with dog heads. They combine. They combine the two enemies I hate the most. They put crows' heads on dogs and dog heads on crows. Lead elixir. They 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 combined. They combined my two my two greatest nemeses. What are you even doing up there? Fuck off! Hey, another chonk! God, please stop! God damn it! You guys are awful to get to separate! I'm a shirt. Fuck, I don't care anymore, dude. I don't care. I'll fucking pull the. Le oh, hey, there's an elevator here. This looks like a shortcut. They're lit, at Hey, I recognize. Hey, yes! I don't even need that elevator. I don't even need that elevator. Aha! The only annoying thing is I'll have to wait for this every time I want to go down. Unless I can really, like, just juke it and get out. Yeet! Okay, it does take a second for the door to close. Okay, good. And there's the baby again. Alright, preparing to do Cthulhu abortion. Okay. It's a good thing my sword's got a hook on the end. Oh, jeez. Oh, God, not skeletons! Oh, not skeletons, they're like a little bit meatier skeletons. Skele- That guy's head. That guy's held together by wishes. That actually was. <laughs> Probably. Oh! Cutscene! Ah, cause. What? Say, cause. Do you hear our prayers? No, we shall not abandon the dream. No one can catch us. No one can stop us now. <laughs> There's eyeballs on the walls. <laughs> hmm. 
Mikalash Cage? Mikalash, host of the nightmare. I was kind of hoping I'd run into Damien while I was in here, because he was a Mensis boy, right? So I was wondering, if, like, is Damien going to be like a guy I have to run into and help, or... Is he just going to run away? Okay. So I guess being held together by wishes means you can just swing your arms non-stop, alright. Hope I like hide and seek. Oh god, it's it's one of those. It's one of those. Oh no. Alright. Alright then. Means a good thing this this cage is here. Cause otherwise, mm, that'd be that'd be not great. Like, I mean, it's like right, it's right there. So I imagine they probably realized, you know what? They'd be really, really annoying if we make people fight to get to a fucking hide and seek boss. So you know what? Let's just put an elevator right there. What's down here? Before I go back in there, what's down here? Oh, the answer is fucking nothing. Fucking nothing is down there. Alright. The corral him to the area you fight him in. Oh, jeez. Oh, uh, oh, jeez, Rick. I gotta find him and just kind of trick him to go into a dead, 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 dead end, yeah? Alright, come here, fucker. I'ma get you. I'ma get you. He fucking looped me! He fucking juked me! God damn it! Son of a bitch! Oh god damn it! He, t he just teleports when you hit him. I'd say asshole and sadist are practically the same thing. Yeah, get fucking bapped! What? This is a- sir, this is a no a woo nightmare? You're gonna have to pay a 350 blood, blood echoes fine. Why is he a wooing? Fucking This dude doesn't even know I'm here. He's just have he's just going on his fucking afternoon run. Got to got to keep his fucking cardio up. Every time I hit him, he go, he just goes, he just teleports. So yeah, I could just, I literally, I could just do, just run, run after him and just whap him when I catch up. Like I lose, I lose nothing. Like all this does is just make it take time. I lose nothing by just whapping you, Mikalash. Back here, you coward! Hey, a new area. All right, now you have to fight me. Oh, he's got those. Is that, is that 
all he's got? Like, is that... Like, is that legit all he has? I mean, okay, his health bar wasn't empty, so he's... Oh, majestic! Hunter is a hunter. Well, yeah, I live in a dream, Dom Dom. Where do you think I go but when I use the lamps? Not too fast. I gotta go find him again. So, yeah, I, I gotta go find him again. Where are you at, Mikalash? How do you not... Whoa, what? Oh, it's a crossbow man. All right, I was gonna say, who the fuck is you? But he's got a fucking cat of nine tails this time. You're the crossbow man. So this guy doesn't... So why does this guy not know his god's name? He's like, I'll hail Cause or... Wait, is it Cosm? Wait, what's our god's name? What branch of Christianity are we again? Yeah, fuck off! Whoop! Bam! Oh, not this! Really, that's... Really? That's what you do? Uh... Does the magic in this game is fucking bullshit. If you want to kill your enemies, clap your hands. And then they all die. That's what it is. Wanna, you wanna see some bullshit? Clap your hands, bump, bump. If you if you're mad and you know it and you really wanna show it, if you want your enemies to die? Clap your hands. Fucking Christ, my dude, that's ridiculous. And I gotta do all of that again. Chase him around till he gets to about one fourth health. Fucking chase him into that room. And then j oh god, and then just chase him again. Now oh, fuck, I'm stuck on him now. If you're annoyed, and you know it, clap your hands. Uh. So why are humans using it then? Like that's that's the question. It's like. Magic in this game is beyond, is just forces beyond human understanding. Like, then why are humans using it? Like, whenever you use that as an explanation for magic, it's like, okay, then why are humans using it? How are humans using it if they don't, if they can't, if it's beyond their ken? Last, if this is the last time I gotta deal with Cthulhu magic, alright, I'm down. I'll take one bad boss fight. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? Oh, that was that was right on. That was right on. He turned that corner to the last second. Oh, I just makes, that's, I'm not even upset. I'm just I'm just sad. Just imagine you're just running away and just all of a sudden just a fucking arrow just hits you in the in the spine. How fucking far do you track? Wait, is he just... Is he letting me do it early? If you're Eldritch and you know it, clap your hands. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, okay, he doesn't know how to visceral.
do the thing. Do the thing. There it is. Ow. Look at the range on that. It's ridiculous. So they're not even really using magic. So why does it have a stat requirement if the slugs are the ones doing all the magic? And they've just got the slugs in their- Did you fucking see how much that crossbow bolt did? That fucking crossbow dealt half of my fucking health. And then that cat of nine tails did the rest. That's... Oh boy, that's... Mm, that's how Mafia works. That's how Mafia works indeed. Like, seriously, this, this isn't a hard fight, it's just... It's just a matter of just, tr like, making sure I hit him enough. You know, it's just like running up to him and just smacking him. That's all, that's all, that's all the fucking, that's all it is. I'm gonna try using the Hunter Bone to, like, evade the tentacles better. Oh, he's just getting right. Okay, he just wants to get right to it. All right. Future is now, old man. These these minions here do more damage than he does. <laughs> ah, god damn it. He's almost down. Teeny tiny coffee bean, what's up? Oh, majestic! The hunter is a hunter. Like, he's not difficult. Dream. It's his minions do more damage than he does. The issue, the issue isn't him, it's his it's his fan club. What's, I didn't even realize there was a staircase now. Oh, and there's a fucking Titanite demon here. No, no, I need that tight. I need that tight. Uh, not tight. Night bloodstone. Whatever the fuck it is. And that guy's got his he's going on. Oh Christ! Ah. 
Hi, well, welcome to the stream. Um, if you wind up liking it, then hey, feel free to, feel free to hit the follow, man, because I stream, like, basically every day. Oh, come on! Oh, no, why you? Alright, upwards we go. I think I had enough of down here. Oh, mm, no. No, thank you, sir. I'll go up. Uh, things I usually I just I get this thing in my head is like no I can I can get him I can get him I got him but then like my brain goes because like, I just fucking forget it's like oh wait no they're gonna get a magic pixel what the fuck I'm sorry what do I do I just jump down. Yes, I jump down. That's what I do. Okay. I'll take those. So he just is gonna teleport into mirrors, huh? What, what was that jukes he just did? Oh, I'm just... Fight me. Oh, big coward. Oh no! 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 I thought that was the way down. Oh no! Oh no! I thought it was the way down. I realized my mistake the second it was too late to correct it. The second it was too late to correct my mistake, I realized what the mistake was. I wonder, could it? I wonder, could I get kill him in first phase by just running after him and just whapping him with the with my sword with running attacks? Like, is that a is that a viable way to fight him? Oh no! Sometimes he'll just go in there at full health. All right. They don't die, do they? They're gonna come back. When they when they were dying, they looked like they were gonna come back, and I was like, "Oh, oh majestic!" No. Is our well, at the very least, we we have the stuff that was downstairs. We never need to go back down there again. I can stagger the tentacle summon. I, you know what? I don't. God, that's half my health. That's half my health. Oh jeez. Oh jeez, Rick. Oh jeez. 
Oh, fucking... Like, why do these, uh... Man, I wish I could go in goddamn cheating mirrors. Alright, so we're gonna find a place to take him. Get in there! I don't know what's in there, but get in there! No, 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 you stay away from that mirror, young man! Ah, oh, god damn it. Iron door key. Where's, where's that? Where's, where's this door? I'll, I'll take the cold blood at least. Like when he's, when he's giggling like a madman? There he is! Get back here, young man. You've got to go to Sunday school. <laughs> that's okay. That's the way. That's the original door. Okay, good. Aha, you fool! Hung by your own patat. God damn it! Uh, okay, so what? What is in here? In here is library room. There's no way out, but... Oh, there's a way down here. He could just jump in here. Ah, oh, you fool. Oh my god, did I break him? Oh my god. Okay, so charge attacks don't work because he's at a bad angle. Someone fucking... Someone clip this when I get close to killing him, alright? Bo Bone Ash does not affect the bow, unfortunately, as far as I'm aware. Because it only affects the left-hand firearm. Like, when I kill him with this, someone clip it. Like, make the biggest clip you can. Because this is just fucking broken. Or even clip this. Right here. I don't know. Clip any part of it. Because this is ridiculous. Oh, damn it. He was moving. I... I didn't, I feel like maybe the game, the base game didn't, didn't have any, uh, idea that the, that the bow blade would be this broken. So he's just been in this dream for, like, ever, yeah? He's just been in this dream for, like, ever. So that body I touched to get in here, that was him, right? He's been asleep so long that his fucking body just died. So I just killed the guy who was dreaming all this. What's gonna happen? Thank you for the bit, Zephyr! Wake me up! Wake me up inside! I can't wake up! So that's why there was a side passage. Because that goes up. All right, now, where is the lamp? What, I'm legit? No, you know what's interesting? You know what's in more interesting than fighting someone legit? Finding out how to make them look like a giant dummy. There's nothing better than making someone look like an idiot. You can quote me on that. Alright. Go see the Odeon. Alright, let's go see the Odeon, boys. Oh. Well, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You don't need to have killing him in it. It's fine. Because honestly, like, it's just, this, it's just more the same. Thank you, Teeny Tiny. Welcome Remember, home. kids, what there's nothing it? wrong with cheating if you don't now? get caught. 
Let the echoes become let me. Why is Anna so powerful? Because Anna's powerful because she can't have kids. Like Anna is a character that that cannot have children of her own unless she has them with Robin. So as a result, she has to be made stronger so that she's relevant for longer. It's like Donnie. Donnie, he starts off really weak, but once you get him going because of aptitude, he becomes really, really strong to the point where he can outpace a lot of the child characters, and he has really, really good class selection. Um, because, because, Farewell, good like I said, like, Donnie is a paralog character, so you can get him. World. So, like, when, once you get him, you have to do a special side mission to get him, so if they made him irrelevant, then it would feel like you completed that side quest for nothing, you know? Same with Anna. But Anna, being a female character, is one of the few female characters that can't have children. Because remember, the fe female characters are the ones that determine the children. So they make Anna stronger um, in order to make her basically become obsolete slower. Uh, but she does eventually get outpaced by the kids in the, like, I think after Walhart. But by then, like, the game's, like, almost over, so... This is like only like six more maps after that. Uh, Cathedral Ward. Uh, oh no, I'm allergic to cheese! <clears throat> oh god, who, who, who just messaged me? Oh god, I... I've got so many fucking like messages on Twitter. Oh, not Twitter, uh... Um... Whatchamacallit? On Reddit, I made a I made a post explaining how um, Brazil loosening their gun laws is probably a good idea since they have a really bad issue with gangs essentially running the country. Oh, where'd she go? You know, and I just basically explained the logic that the fucking uh, president is using, and like people have just been sh like fucking either agreeing or fucking shouting each other down, like, all day, and I'm just like, oh man, look at all these people who think they know how fucking shit works. Like, I don't know how shit works, I'm just saying what the fucking- I was just saying, like, what the thought process behind the decision was. There ain't no more civil- Your name's <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah, follow the Cthulhu blood. She- She can't have gone down here, could she? Wait, did I read this? Bergenworth spider hides all manner of rituals and keeps our lost master from us. A terrible shame. Makes my head shut. Oh, fuck! Patches! She can't be down here, can she? Oh, something's happening. How did you get this chair down here? You want me to... You want me to take care of it? Oh shit! Well, that was annoying. Didn't mean to do that. Well... Pff. Um, a great relic, also known as Court of the Eye. Every Great One loses its child and then yearns for a surrogate, and Odeon, the formless Great One, is no different. To think, it was corrupted blood that began this eldritch liaison. Used to gain insight, and so they say, eyes on the inside, though no one remembers what that truly entails. So she got him knocked up by the Great One attached to the church, I assume. Killing the child kills her as well. Welp! Delicious. No, 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 no. Just devour that fucking eldritch placenta. Well, shit. So tainted blood. So she's been giving us. Hang on. So her blood. Monster of the church is amygdala. So wait, I killed amygdala though, and there's still a monster attached to the church. Blood taken from Ariana, Cathedral Ward, Woman of Pleasure. The sweet blood of Ariana restores HP and temporarily. Remember, the old healing church would know that her blood is similar to precisely what was once forbidden. 
So she was a blood saint, right? And then she got kicked out and became a prostitute. Is that what that's supposed to be? Because it says that, like, because another thing said only blood saints have blood that heals. And she, and she was a prostitute. Hi, Graham. Graham. <laughs> Can I have more Flintstones, Turbo Morphine? Thank you, Graham. Graham. <laughs> There's more than one amygda amygdala, they're just lesser gods. Oh! Oh, oh, amygdala is not a name, it's a type. It's a, it's a type of person, or a type of monster, whatever. Okay, that's weird. Alright then. Uh, we got our shoes. I mean, we killed off one of the babies, so we just saved the day, right? Shoes worn by Ariana, night, woman of the night in the theater ward. Innocent and cute, in contrast with its owner. Oh my god, look at my pretty little shoes. Look at these bare legs. There's one on the church, one over by the engine jungle, and you look around there. I thought each of them had a different name. And Amygdala was just the one I got the name of because Patches was worshipping it in the nightmare. Oh well. Alright. Um. Um. Alright, so let's go here. I want to have a look around this area now that I've cleared it out, because I've been seeing, like, chunks and rocks and shit around- uh, not chunks, uh, not rocks, but chunks. And I wouldn't mind getting some- getting some- getting some more chunks. Because I need a- I need one blood rock for Simon's bow blade, but I think I still need, like, four more- four more chunks? Four more chunks for my, uh, cane, and I do want to keep the cane current as well, because the cane is good for stuff the bow blade's not. Hi, Bevington. The one in the nightmare was a greater amygdala. The rest of them are lessers. Oh, okay then. Kind of a weird distinction, but all right. So that's two bosses down. That's two bosses down in one stream. We ain't even done yet. Oh fuck you, buddy. Not that any women of good breeding blood saint. They want to control the. Oh, so. You don't have to be part of the church to be a blood saint. You just gotta, like, have have the good blood. The blood that's got the Cthulhu's in it. So if you if you cut your wrist and you see a couple of tentacles pop out, oh yeah, no, that's a blood saint right there. Oh, and imagine this is probably where I was supposed to fight him. Right here. Lure him in there and fight him. Uh, and I think... I think I might have actually gotten everything. Let's just have one quick look around. Um, yeah, no, I think I got everything. So, only other place to go is out the way that lantern was, or go downstairs and try and scoot past fucking Biggie Smalls down there. Because I mean, we set, we found a, we found a Titanite demon. We found a Titanite demon there. And, oh boy, oh, oh boy, okay, all right, I can, all right, let's have a, let's have another look out here, no, not out here, where's, I'm lost again, I am lost again, I have, I have lost, I've gotten lost, uh, this way, there didn't be a nun in BC, Odeon will still pick the pro, hey man, Odeon knows what he likes, Alright, don't kink shame him. Odeon knows what he likes. So what happens if you get the nun in there but you don't get the prostitute? Does the does it pick the does it pick the nun then or does he just not get the umbilical cord? The nun will kill the What the fuck? Fuck! Oh god damn it, it's right there! It's right there! Oh, you fucking sack of garbage.
So why does the nun kill the prostitute? Is it because she's secretly against Odeon giving, like, impregnating someone? Take prostitute blood two months and nun kills her. Well, what the fuck? What the fuck, nun? Oh, God, I looked away from the screen for like half a second, expecting I could run through so I could check the chat. Uh, re, re, he said. Alright, come on, we still got like fucking. Depending on when my food gets here, because I'm hungry. Depending on when my food gets here, we've got like up to an hour left. So I want to get some, I want to get some stuff done. Like they really just don't want to stack or do that. I got plenty of these fucking vials left, friend. It's interesting that there's no bleeding mechanic. That there's, that there's like, that it's said things that you think would cause bleeding, like whips instead do, um, uh, heavy poison. Hold on to your bone. That is a good question. The answer is no. The answer is no. Moon runes! I literally got fuck. I literally got a moon rune. Jump force open beta. Eh, not really. It could. I when I first saw uh, jump force announced, I was like, oh hey, that looks interesting. But like as more stuff has come out, I'm like, man, that game looks really fucking ugly. <laughs> and also like the picks are really really safe. Oh yeah, we never checked this one. Chad breaks a labyrinth seal. Great chalices unlock deeper rooms. It was also the first great chalice brought back to the surface at a time. Birkenworth it allowed the choir to have an audience with Ebriatus. Oh man. Yeah, there's no bleeding. It's only um. Moon rune. Hey, hey, I can get that. I get the like the, the whips and all that. They only do uh, heavy poison. They don't actually do. Any bleed damage. Just weird. Like when I first saw the logo, the the symbol for for heavy poison, I was like, oh no, that's bleeding. But then it popped, then I actually got hit by it fully, and it's like, hey, you're now heavily poisoned. Why has this boy got so much poise? Whips don't do heavy poison by default. No, they don't. I have my whip, um, but my my whip has poison on it, and and it does extra damage to beasts and all that shit, but. But yeah, like the 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 whips that these guys use, the cat of nine tails, and the fucking giant, uh, the giant fucking axe that the big fat man is using, like those all do heavy poison. When in Dark Souls they would do bleed. That's really weird. This is gonna suck. This is gonna suck unless I can find a way to make this work. Woof! No! 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 Fighting this guy in a stairway is not my ideal. All right, okay. I'll take the bl I'll take the blood gem. Believe bleed made you lose your egg. Oh god, that would be fucked. 
Maybe blood poison? I don't know. It's it's really weird. It's really weird, like, what does what in this game sometimes. Because it feels like sometimes it's just like something does something different than what it does than the, its equivalent in uh, Dark Souls. Just because this game wants to be different than Dark Souls. And honestly, I don't blame it. It's just for Libra's partners. Uh, Libra's lame, so no. <laughs> Libra sucks. Fuck Libra. You know what? Pair Libra with Tharja. Let's see if she can make him miserable. I should probably go back to the dream. Oh boy. <laughs> no, he's not. No, he's not. Mateo, have you, Mateo, haven't you? Was it? Weren't you there when I recruited Libra? Or, or have you not been watching the Fire Emblem streams? <laughs> Libra's a dude, voiced by a woman. Well, what is it? Very well. Yeah, so did Chrom. Libra is the Libra is the game's gay joke. Or everyone, or everyone looks at Libra and goes, "Damn, she got a booty," and he's like, "Sup, friend?" Like. If you know, if you look at his class, you see that he's a war monk, which is the male version of war cleric. Gems, don't worry, I'm doing my, my, my gems. Uh, tempering damp blood gem. Oh, fuck, just straight up, like, 18%. Alright. Skill 7 plus 12. I'm gonna just get... Yeah, that'll do. That'll do, pig. Tempering damp. Yeah, that's good. That's fine. What does the eye rune do? I don't remember. Make additional discoveries. More items from fallen enemies. So basically, it just increases drop rate, which I don't really care about right now. I heard a decent amount. He goes on about like, something called cause, or some say cosm. And he wants to be granted eyes. Shit like that. Seemed like he was repeating himself, more or less. Unless, like, I was supposed to get a third phase. Okay. Oh, it's you. Excellent. Wait your turn, Doggo! Doggo Pro! We would upgrade the cane now. Third part of having also jump down. Oh, alright. There's that fucking baby again. Oh no. This is the part where bosses become Hey, okay, and why is and this just goes right back down to where I was at, right? Why is this here? There's a lantern not that far. Why would I I mean, I guess it allows me to skip the doggo pros, or I guess maybe if I need to get all the way back down without going through a load screen, but... But what's the point? Is there something I gotta jump out onto? No, this is just straight up... Wait, no, there it is. There it is. And I'm, I'm 
and that goes there, I imagine. Okay, let's do that in a minute. Let's do that in a minute. Let's see what the weaves want to do first. Hello, friends! Remember me? We're back! Oh, shit. Wow, you guys suck now. Ah, god. Alright, no, he sucked. You're okay. Oh, wait, no, you, you also suck. So, I imagine I killed the strong ones back in the forest, and these are just what's left, right? Those guys kind of suck. Like, a lot. <laughs> okay. So let's head this way, see what's up. There's more. They're just gonna be a, a, an enemy type now, aren't they? An enemy type that's all over this fucking area. But where'd he go? Did he, did he fucking fall? He fucking fell? Wow, you guys came a long way from being a boss. I guess when you get defeated in the real world, when you come back to the nightmare, you just kind of get demoted if you get sh if you got shit on in first try. As you once did for the vacuous realm, grant us eyes, grant us eyes, plant eyes in our brains to cleanse our beastly idiocy. So basically, Rom was a big dumb spider because this cosm thing put eyes in its brain. So imagine it, it used to be a dude. And then this Cosm got to it, and Cosm made him retarded. Now, n now I can understand nihilism, but that's gone a little far. That's gone a little far. When was I in the real world? No, no I was though. I was, though. I was in the real world. That's why this is where you gotta... It says, awaken. Whenever you, whenever you, whenever you uh, use the, use the thing. Whenever you use the hunter's mark, it says, reawaken. Which means that the hunter's dream and this... Are, the, are, are dreaming. And the yarn itself is awake. Don't, don't, don't say the silly things. Because otherwise, the fucking game's internal logic doesn't make sense. Because how do you wake up within a dream? And also, the whole game being a dream would be really fucking lame. That pig got eyes. He's got a lot of eyes. Also... Nice to see that even though the pigs have changed a little bit, the fucking lock-on bug with them still ha still still fucking doesn't work. Good. That thing fucking charged as I tried to fucking dodge around it, and it came unlocked and just I got shit on. Excellent. I love enemies like that where the game doesn't want to stay locked on. For them. Inception was a bad film. Fight me. Maybe I can't counter with the, with the bang. Ah, oh, like by like a second. Okay, so like I I had an issue with the pigs before. Where when they charged, I would have an issue where like the game would just randomly unlock from them. That's what I'm talking about. It wasn't. That shit won Academy Awards, man. It won. It. 
Ask bait. Oh, okay. I mean, I was mostly just being a facetious asshole. Because it, it, you'd think that that would have come up in testing, that sometimes when the pigs charge, you just fucking randomly unlock from them. fucking get good that's really that's a really good answer to just like the game having a really fucking bad bug i guess you can use get good on anything if it's fucking programmed poorly enough imagine if that's what david cage did hey uh david omicron the nomad soul's a giant sack of shit um as uh, as my uh, japanese friend would say that you have to uh, get good at the emotions Omicron is a perfect game. You just have to get good. Fuck. Get. Balls. Dicks. That was a fair trade. That was a fair enough trade. All right. Hey, dum dum. Wow, you really suck at your job, Zach. I thought he was gonna go for a swing. Instead, he just just whapped it at me. That's what I was expecting. But, I mean, if there's a thing where, like, a mechanic is supposed to work a certain way, like, say, locking onto a pig, and then if that pig does, a, does one of its main moves, the game just can't keep track of the lock and breaks it, that's a bug that is the game's fault and it's not part of the player's skill or lack thereof, especially when the pig has put that ability also fucks the player up real good. Well, good for those masochists. I bet they I bet they abuse the shit out of exploits. Cause this game's got a lot of They give out some uh, some stuff, some goody some goodie bags. Okay, you wanna fucking fucking see that? I was behind a wall and that hit me. Like fucking, he didn't even touch me. He just moved on past. Usually you'd think you'd be safe with that, but no, the hurt box in the car is bigger than the fucking himself. Ridiculous. I mean, that's kind of hard when they start that far away, man. Did not. I fucking. I was. I was watching that man. It did not. I swear to God. Is him. I might want to keep the sedatives on. Oh, this is gonna be a bunch of those guys. Hmm. Hey, guys. Now, question is... 
Yeah, no, that's not gonna work. Good. Worth a try. Now, one of you could just... Okay, you're the one who's gonna wanna... who's gonna keep this... No, wait, that's you. Yes! That's one. not bursting into snakes this time. They're big, they're big scary snake boys. And they really enjoy slithering around the village hidden in the sound. I don't know, dude. Maybe they just like represent like the fucking congealed nightmares of the people of Yarnum or some shit like that. Something metaphysical. I mean, because apparently they live in the nightmare, and the ones that are in the fucking real world were spooky as shit. I have- FUCKING- And also, they are assholes, it would seem. Chan will never betray me. Yarnum is the future. Yeah, Yarnum is the future site of the village hidden in the sound, didn't you know? What the fuck's going on over here, dude? What's going on? I spy a Titanite demon! That must mean I'm going the right way, yeah? Nope, I am. This is the opposite of the right way. Someone left the sink. Oh, God. Yeah, someone in, like, like behind this behind this wall is the fucking, like, bathroom or something. Someone just left the sink on, like, for, like, a... It's just been seeping through the stones. They sent those two shadows to try and figure it out, but they're not- but they're fucking snake men, not plumbers, and they've just been standing here confused. Someone get fucking Vadi on that. Someone get Vadi Vigil on that, explain- explain who left the sink on. There's the lady. Hello, friend. What? What has happened? So it looks like she's facing towards what has to be a boss door. Unable to acquire it. Why was Yosefka's blood in there? Why was Yosefka's blood in there? Hey, okay, and that's the way back to a bonfire. Oh, no, bonfire, a lamp, good. Uh, so, let's just look what she's looking up at. She's looking up at... She's looking up at nothing. But that's, a, that's obviously a boss room in there. Want a hint? A hint about what? Like, that's very clearly a boss room. If that's not a boss room, I'll eat my hat. I'll eat my butt. What? Oh yeah, fucking, what's up? Like, like how, how? What, what happened? Oh, that leads down here. Like, why was Josefka's blood here? Like, Josefka, like... 
He's not hanging around here. Yosefka wasn't trying to do that. Fake Yosefka was. Or were they or were they in cahoots? It was the fake Yosefka that was doing the fucking Cthulhu's. Oh, come on! No. no. Fake never gave me nothing. The real Yosefka... When I first met the real Yosefka... Real Yosefka gave me a vial of her blood. And then she got replaced. And then fake Yosefka would give me things like the numbing mist. Yeah. Like... That's why there's that that's there, at least. Yeah, like fake Yosefka like gave me the numbing mist and all that. Real Yosefka gave me blood. What the fuck? I bounced off it twice. What though? Slender, I was I was rolling into it. I if I was jumping, I would have taken a running start. Like, it's a big enough fucking window. Ah! I was fucking level with it, almost. It's a big fuck-off window, like... I shouldn't bounce off the fucking empty space at the top of a window. I'll take this. But yeah, so why was Yosefka's blood there? Like, because fake Yosefka was the one who was doing the Cthulhu's. Real Yosefka was actually trying to help people. Oh, god damn it, not you! He's the one. He's the one causing the fucking castle. And he likes to sing. La, la, la. Oh god damn it! Things are there up here, man. Like, is it just the one or 
Like, was that was that one guy fucking doing all that? Fuck! They always sing above 50 in sight. They leave all forms of the bell ringing maidens. Uh, great. So I guess I'm gonna try and run past her then. Gonna get my, gonna get my echoes, my souls, whatever the fuck you wanna call it. Run past and just like just neck neck some fucking uh, sedatives on my way down. I'm gonna have to go speak with Gram Gram in a minute. And get some get some more fucking some of these Flintstones tubal tubal morphine. Can't sneak up on her and like she'll see you coming first. And, like just can't do it. Here's hoping I don't fucking fall off the fucking lift again. That was 10k souls, and that's... Not 10k, 100k souls, and that's... I'm... Are you fucking kidding me? That's bullshit. That's fucking bull... No, oh, I'm keeping this in sight. That's fucking stupid. That's fucking stupid, and I hate it. Why is the window so narrow? I swear to god, there better be a fucking, like, automatic blowjob machine at the other end of this fucking bridge if they're gonna make this fuck that annoying to climb in. I swear to god. <laughs> I mean, dude, the fucking bosses this stream, like, been nothing. Fucking Ebriatus, done in two. Fucking, uh, Nicolas Cage, fucking, like, that was like, okay, one, the first one is Recon. Done in fucking, done in like three. Elevator boss? Fucking, hmm. Greatest enemy. Swear to God, if I get the other side of that bridge, gather going through the frenzy and that. Oh boy. But they're not lined up. The door, I the door to get get into the elevator and the fucking door to and the window are not lined up, so there's an overlap where the fucking elevator opens up to... opens up to wall. Blood rock. Well... Fucking for real! So I gotta get that blood rock then, cause I need one. Get that blood rock, and I can up then I can upgrade the the bow blade to full, and then be then be done. Be like, right, end game weapon. Here we go. And then I just keep an eye out for the other one to upgrade the cane.
I... I don't understand. I don't understand. Like, what am I doing wrong? I don't, un I don't get it. I'm lining it up, I'm walking forward, and... I'm going up! Wait, let's, let's wait for the fucking slow-ass elevator twice! It doesn't help that because of the cloth, I can't really see what's happening. Fucking, I almost fell out. I almost fucking fell out the window. And there's another one, for fuck's sake! Now there's a bunch of fucking spider boys. Are they, what are they, Patchy's brothers? What the fuck? Alright. Fuck no, I ain't doing that. Did not expect a cutscene for a fucking lever. All right, all right, Ben. What? Is that the thing that was making everyone's head explode? Fuck's sake, not oh not here too. A cap. No. Oh, that's the Oh, okay, that's the thing that gets you on approach. Alright. Please tell me this is this is the rock. Please tell me this is the rock over here. I don't want to come back here again. Arcane damn blood gem. Well, great one's wisdom. Great one's wisdom. Great one's wisdom. Please give me the rock. So that so that thing is basically like what these guys walking around will turn into eventually, right? They they just keep getting more and more eyes until just fucking they become that. Please, where's, where's my rock? Please give me my rock. My rock made of blood. Oh fuck, that's what that was for. Alright then. Oh wait, and now we're back- now we're back in here.
I mean, it, it didn't look like it was a bunch of them bound together. It looked like it was just one big one. Like the tentacles coming off the bottom kind of look like the stuff coming out of like their coming out of their body. Yeah, blood tinge gem. Ooh, I could use that. More blood tinge damage is always good. Oh fuck! Sake. Where's my rock? Uh, heck. I need my safety rock. Is that my rock? Are you my rock? Yes, it is. And there's no way out but down. It's probably gonna kill me. Yeet! Yep. That's fine. That's fine. I don't care. Basically, Mensa's attempt to create an old one, but they come out right, so it's corrupted by hatred and evil. Aren't Cthulhu's just kind of that by default? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter if there's a way out. I needed to fast travel back to the lamp. The lamp. Kind of neutral. How can you be neutral when you're making people's heads explode? gonna use all these. Fortify weapon. Chonk. And rock. Yeet. Alright, so now I just need one more weapon master. Yeah! Alright. Blood gem fortification. Oh, we should have uh, boosted Evelyn, too. But we got something to do first. Blood attack up 21 points. Yeah, fuck. Yeah, no, do that. Fortify weapon. Still only one slot, huh? Yeah, there's only one slot. Well. Third hand in the dra- Alright, alright, I'll turn in the dregs. I should be able to do a lot of damage with the uh, with the actual bow part of the bow. Hi, vampire wife. Closest of kin. I want to turn in these bloods. Thy gift pleases us. Okay. So are you got any got any presents? Let this. No, just just more blood, huh? <laughs> Just, just more blood. We await for the all. All right then. I mean, she gave me something when I gave her the first two dregs I gave her, but I don't know. I think we're at like five dregs right now. I think. Sure. Let's go to middle and use the elevator. Let's go up and fight that boss. Let's fight that boss. Fight him dead. I remember the spot where the fatty and the archer grew trouble with the whole group. Um, and that thing.
Oh, so they're just chaotic evil then. They do what they want and damn everyone else. That's it. That's that's chaotic evil, that is. Well no, they're doing it like fucking like without we like literally like no regard for other people. Like at all like a chaotic neutral will be like Chaotic Neutral won't stab someone in the face if it benefits them. That's where you get into, like, Chaotic chaotic Evil, I, I, I would've thought. Like, someone who's Chaotic... Chaotic... Oh, boy, look at all of these fucking cage boys. Wait, hang on. So, I mean, I, didn't I get one of those hats? Someone who's Chaotic Neutral steal your car? Someone who's chaotic evil will stab you in the face and use your head as a as a fucking hood ornament because it fucking made them laugh. Tire of the choir, a high ranking members of the healing church. Members of the choir, both the highest ranking clerics of the high, high healing church and scholars who continue the work that began in Bergenworth. The eye covering mask indicates their debt to teaching their debt to the teaching of Master Willem, even though their paths diverged. Oh, that's nice. Then I yeah, there it is. The school of Mensis controls the unseen village. This hexagonal iron cage suggests their strange ways. The cage is the device that restrains the will of the self, allowing one to see the profane world for what it is. It also serves as an antenna that facilitates contact with the great ones of the dream. But to an observer, the iron cage appears precisely what delivered them to the harrowing nightmare. Ah, oh, that's spooky. Hmm. Oh, so they don't even know people. It's like like ants, basically. That's baby carriage. That's a big bird. With an invisible head. It's a big crow with an invis- Mirko's wet nurse. All right, that's a name for it, for it. all right. Oh yeah, no, that thing does not care about staggering. All right. Fuck. I don't know what this thing deal is. I, like, is it looks like just swinging. I'm just gonna just, uh, see what it does. Oh, that's good. Okay. All right. Okie doke then. That's what he's behind it, isn't it? No, it's not hitting behind it. But it can summon a fucking mini me that does. Okay then. Fuck. Which one's the real one? Are you the real one? Uh, is there a real one? Fuck it. Alright! Fuck it, how many of them are there? Like, fuck! I, I thought the one of the that other one that came out was like an illusion, but no, there's just fucking multiples. God, it just spawned behind me, dude. Oh fuck me. Yeah, that was a little tiny bit ridiculous, like a little tiny bit. Oh fuck me. Oh, God damn it! I got stuck in a cage. There's one wet nurse. It's just it's just making multiple of itself, right? So they so do those fade away or do they actually exist in the darkness? So I could lock onto them, or does the wet nurse change which one is the real one? Oh boy. Mist is a more falsehood. So. Question. What if I put this on? 
and look like an idiot. Because this lets me see everything. This is supposed to let me see everything for real, right? I just got this cage and it, and it was said it was made specifically to deal with this shit. Get closer. Okay, I'm not noticing any difference. And hopefully he can't hit me. Oh no, it was just a, an illusionary one. <laughs> I would really like it if this fucking wet nurse would stop. God, they're just turning into like a fucking blender, dude. Ah! How was I even supposed to see that coming? Fuck. Me. In the butt. Okay, 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 so, I, so it does wear off. So it's a matter of surviving long enough. There you are. Fuck! This matter surviving long enough in the mist. Good, he just goes back to just one. Alright, that does it behind it. Oh no, he got a big spin. Alright, he got a big spin. that missed shit again. If possible, I should charge, but when I have time, so do an absurd amount of. D I, you know, I imagine so. I just didn't want to deal with its bullshit. Nightmare slain. I didn't want to like deal with like getting a third umbilical cord. Wow, you just you just get one for free, huh? Yeah, uh, fucking. I, I, I love the bow. Oh, I just wish I just wish like the bullets were a little bit easier to come by. All right, let's. Uh... So I just killed a baby, huh? A great relic, also known as the cord of the eye. Every infant great one has this precursor to the umbilical cord. Every great one loses its child and yearns for a surrogate. This cord granted Mensis audience with Murgo, but resulted in the stillbirth of their brains. Fuck it, Jesus. Well, I'm running on three-fourths and umbilical cords. Let's go. A bit more chalice is nice now. Wait, you mean, you mean like I should go into the chalice? In chalice dungeon? We'll do that. I don't feel like doing the DLC. I, I do want to, I do want to do the DLC. Oh, shit! 
Um. Uh. Uh, why is my house on fire? Good hunt. Dawn will soon break. This night and this dream will end. Gammon awaits you at the foot of the great tree. What? Very well. Let the echoes become German your strength. German awaits you at the foot of the... Wait, what? Let me stand close. Wait, was that the last boss? That didn't feel like a last boss. One, two, three, four. Okay, four. So we'll go one, 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 one. Don't go meet with German. All right. Oh, see, so now when the game is telling me to go find German, you're telling me, oh god, Grandpa fucking, Grandpa, Grandpa set the fucking, Grandpa set the place on fire. German's the second to last boss. Now that the house is burning, do everything except find German. All right. So, yeah, there's nothing to do here now. I guess let's poke around a little bit, see if there's anything else to do. They said go down the lift, right? What am I supposed to look for? Am I supposed to find something in here? And there's that lady. I, I killed your kid. Oh, she bowed. Oh, so she she was she got done like uh, she got done like Adelia did. She was forced to like give birth to a fucking Cthulhu monster, and now her ghost has been hanging around waiting for someone to come kill it. Oh shit, dude. That's really nice storytelling, actually. But uh, that's really not- oh wait, what the fuck am I doing? I'm done in here. I, I think I've done everything. I'm 99% sure I've done everything. Are there any- what, what, I thought her name was Adelia. Ariana. Where am I getting Adelia from? Is that a Dark Souls person? Uh, there's also the lift to the thing. The brain of is down the elevator in the room I had trouble with earlier. With the big fella and the archer boys. Eh. So are there any bosses I'm missing? Like, was that the last boss of the main game other than... Be another cage elevator I can take down to the abyss. Oh, is that a... Oh, wait, is that guy a boss? That's where I do make contact. Okay. So... Where are the lead boys? Go to the base. I think. And then it's here, right? I'm wrong. No boss from here on, all boss besides German and the DLC. This... Yeah, this is it. Okay. This is where the lead boys were. Ah, fuck! Sprinting to turn around, my one weakness. Oh, we're... I, I, I don't think we're gonna, like, really hit the DLC this time, because we're gonna go, like... So, okay, so right now, technically, I should end the stream, but I'm waiting for my food to get here, because I ordered it to be delivered at 9 o'clock. So, because the, the place cl because the place closes, it closes in, uh, at, like, 15 past. So, right now, we're going to keep going with the stream until either we hit 9.30 or uh, my food gets here, whichever one comes first.
So, go ahead with lead assholes there. There'll be another cage elevator I can take down from this. Um. I don't see it. I passed it. Oh shit, there it is. Oh fuck, I didn't even see that. Later, fuckers! Yeah, fuck, I'm in this cage, you can't get me in here. Oh, this is the abyss, holy shit. When did this get here? Was this always here? Was, was this always here? Um, do I... Do I step out? Gonna walk forward. It's only there when you drop the brain. Oh boy, this guy's got a lot of eyeballs. Um, come on. There it is. So what am I... Okay, so I run the big guy and do it into my character swaps arms. So let's see, what's hap what's gonna happen here? You can just hear the, like, this heartbeat kind of thing. Oh, boy. You wanna you wanna swap arms there, girl? Fuck, it looks like you get like I don't wanna look at this thing for longer than I have to. Okay. Alright, there's the switch. Moon moon! Okay, now now what? Do I do I stab it? Do I stab the thing? That's the best moon. The great ones inhabit the nightmare are sympathetic in spirit and can often answer when called upon. There is no one out. Oh man, he's a strong boy. All right, let's see. Well, how much this does? Four thirty-seven. Not bad. Gotta put it out of its misery. By causing it a little bit more misery. Alright, well, we'll put that in. I would have thought I would have got like a message or something, like, hey, we're on our way, friend. Remember, kids, if you order food, always leave like fucking 10 15 minutes in your direction for to fucking get there. Nah, I'm not gonna waste the bullet. I'd rather just stab it. But I'm pretty sure I'm got- I've got to be running low on bullets. By now. Right, later, bird light. Living string! Well, that looks- that sounds spooky. Um... Um...
Uh, the immense brain that Mensis retrieved from the nightmare was indeed lying with eyes on the inside, but they were of an evil sort, and the brain itself was terribly rotten. But even still, it was a legitimate great one, and left a relic. Living relic at that, which is a precious thing indeed. Fucking spoopy. Alright. So I guess now we've got to try and get out. Ah, oh, sorry, Slender. Alright, so... I think DLC... DLC next stream. Alright, we'll see how far we can get with that. Then we'll go see what German wants. I'm assuming that Ger cause German set the fucking house on fire, the Germans... German started drinking the Great One Kool-Aid, huh? Like, he know he realized, like, hey, wait a minute, you're killing Cthulhu's? Dude, what the fuck? I hired you to kill werewolves. So he just kind of, like, so he just kind of burned the house down. He's going, like, I'm gonna fucking get you from my wheelchair. Fuck, don't make me get my belt. Saving the child's from... Uh, we're gonna do some chat- we're not gonna- probably not gonna go through all of the chat ascendants, because aren't they just, like, randomized? We'll- we'll kill some time, like, at the end, because this stream, we're basically at the end. Like, like I said, I'm just waiting for food, right? Um, so what we'll do is, we'll go in there now, and then next stream we'll do DLC. We'll get as far as we- as far as we can in the channels we've already done. I mean, we've still got 15 minutes left in the stream, so I've still got to record. I've still got to record the thing for No Game No Life this this week. So hopefully, so I'm gonna do that. The bullshit chess game. Because he was telling me to go into the tombs of the gold to kill stuff. Yeah, that's a fair point, actually. Maybe he just changed his mind. Maybe I'm killing the. Maybe I'm killing the Cthulhu's too well, and he's just like, Nah, dude, come on. Leave some for the rest of us. Main houses have a lore hidden in its depths and an interesting bo- Ooh, spooky. That's a spooky, scary skeleton right there. Alright, Sumerian Labyrinth Layer 2. Okay, so I went through here a bit and I just kind of like... got stuck in a loop. So let's see what's going on here. And if then failing that, I'll just activate one of the other chalices. Oh fuck! I forgot. Yeah, no, I have out. I have out leveled this chalice. I've out leveled this chalice bigly. Oh no. That's a big guy with a hammer. Fucking, you weren't here before. How's a guy that fat rolling around so well? Fuck me. Like he do it, dude. He fucking do it. Unlocked. Somewhere, a door to the old labyrinth has opened. One of the unique bosses which shows some of the lore from the past. Okay, let's try and get that then. Let's try and go through here. Silver bullets. I mean, uh, hopefully I haven't out-leveled this as badly as I think I have. Because, oh no. Like, these guys... Oh no, these, these, poor, these poor men. His fucking uh, his equipment load is, was low, so he could so he just roll around. All right, let's try and get back to the to the opening. I know it loops around here. Yeah, here's the door. Here's the door I can open. This will just loop. Yep, that loops. I can go through here. Oh fuck, this isn't where I thought it was. Merciless Watcher. Oh! <laughs> oh, fucking. Sorry, friend. 
Merciless, you say? Ah! That poor bastard can't even fucking stand two. But I feel like a bully. Oh, jeez, I feel like a bully for that. Yeah, definitely, definitely left these too late. Because <laughs> I'm not even getting any bloodstones that are worth a shit. Alright, down we go. I got another root chalice for a dungeon I'm already in. Unless that's a different one. Oh no, Thumuru, that's the Thumuru root chalice. So what's the difference? Oh, this one's the randomized one. That one's for like, if you need random stuff to happen. Yeah. So the one I, the one I used to get in here is like, okay, here's how you get to the one that's like, we've actually designed. And then it's like, if you want to go to a randomized one that's like set to your level, then use the root one. That's probably what it is. Doop. Okay, let's see. Yep, everyone here is still a coward. Prospector Olek? Why do I need a fucking... Summon for? Not by device. What would I need a summon for? These guys are bitches. You're a bit specific because you're in dungeon for some unimplemented bosses. Oh fuck, really? That's cool. I mean, and at least they got some uh, usage out of those things. I just tossed them in the trash. Oh, I'm really hungry right now. Oh shit! All right. All right, I'm just gonna keep moving. Keep walking. Loot dungeons have wandering bosses. Mm, I don't think I like the sound of that. Shit. Was that sack? Was that a sack man? That is a sack man indeed. Hey, Sackman! Remember this? I fucking missed. It's like, yeah, I can't see his head. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? There it is! Fucking, oh, Bloodstone shot. I don't even need those anymore! Oh, rip in peace, Sackman. Remember when he was a threat? For like that one time when he caught me unawares? Wait, where the fuck am I supposed to be going? Like seriously, where where am I where am I supposed to be going? Yeah, fuck I, this is a really low level dungeon. Where go? I don't know where I'm going. I don't know where I'm going. Like 110. Oh wait, up these up these stairs. Okay, that's probably through it. These stairs will probably take me where I need to go. True blood. What do those even do? Like, what do these, what do these ritual materials even do? I didn't see a place to use them. Like, can I make it to use them to make this uh, a little more like level appropriate? Or is it? Well, is it only for the root ones, the ones that are randomized? Like, better question probably is how deep are these fucking things? I 
I feel like such a bully. That's what you want in random. Okay, so that's what you want for random ones. All right. Okie doke. So it's does it work kind of like putting in a passcode in like a fucking old NES game? It's like if you go blood backbone blood blood, you get the you get this level. Right? Is, is that how it works? Right, so we just get back to the entrance. You fight the boss. Where is the entrance? Well, that's an elevator, but it doesn't seem to want to work. Oh! No, oh, there it is. Okay, so it's an, it's an elevator without a button. It's a magic elevator. Okay. And I imagine this is just how to get down. So we'll just hop in here, head back out to the entrance. Thanks, dicks! Head back through the entrance, and then we should then we should be able to go through that door I came in. I, I saw at the start. And then I can just kill a boss by charging the bow. Yep, there it is. Like I'm just gonna I'm gonna run out of bullets before I actually take damage. Okay. Alright, where are you, boss man? Also, how deep are these things usually? Like how many levels are there? Like ten? Five? Six? How many? I'm curious. How has how, how deep these planned ones go? Watchdog of the old lords. Oh look at these big doggos. Oh look, you could take a hit. You could take a hit on your little doggo face. Adorable. Like, I like how the game is like trying to put this thing forward. It's like, look at this, look at this monster. It's so, it's so horrifying. And I'm just like, blinking at it with, with a fucking bow and arrow. Like some sort of fucking caveman. Central Chalice. Chalice breaks a labyrinth seal. Only a root chalice changes the shape of the old labyrinth when using a ritual. The old labyrinth was carved out by the Thumerians. Superhuman beings have unlocked the wisdom of the Eldritch Truth. Okay. Where's the way out? Or, wait, was that it? There's no way out here. Is that it? Just three levels? That was the last boss of the chalice. Central chalice is the next one. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right so let's um let's open it up, see what's going, and then I'm gonna actually and then I'm gonna call and see like where the fuck my food at because that's. I'm getting concerned now because the place closes in fucking. In fact, the clo place is already closed. So, like, where's the delivery boy at? So, if I remove the chalice. I'm use the, this one. Oh, I need ritual blood for it. If I were to do this one. Oh. oh, it's not. Okay, so it's not like per each. Okay, I see. I see how this works. Okay. I've never found the Hinter Tomb Chalice. Where the fuck's that supposed to be at? So I got the Ailing Loran. I don't even have. I don't even have the shit for this. Alright, so I have to go get whatever, uh, thing. Alright. 
gem and await. I mean, I didn't, I didn't know. I didn't Very know he died. Alright. Well, let's go see how we are for, um, for things. Good thing everything inside still works. Oh, we are, oh boy, we are starving for bullets. We are starving for bullets a little bit. check what the church gives? We got the church badge. I don't think we actually checked what it gives us. No, we did. Oh, it doesn't give us anything. Alright. Alright, well, worth a shot. And, oh yeah, and also because we've been killing all these bosses, I haven't actually checked this thing since we're like fucking gas coin almost. Okay. Oh, so it gives me some of that. Blood rock. Oh, I can just buy a blood rock for 60 things. Okay. Right, and then nothing else. Alright. I can just buy a fucking blood rock if I wanted. Don't go below 60. No, it'll bring me down to 40. How many of these do I have? Well, five of these, so that's ten. Seven of those, so I, it would it would bring me down below. Well, shit. Well, shit. Okay, so Evelyn, I need what? Well, I need one more chunk. No, let's get, let's buy a chunk. Let's buy let's buy a chunk. Let's just get everything as high leveled as we can get it. Uh, well, last time I checked, the PvP was pretty dead. Um, but also, I don't have uh, PS, uh, PlayStation, PS Plus, whatever the fuck they want to call it nowadays. I don't have that. Oh, I need souls. Fuck. Alright, well, I'll, I'll deal with that. I'll deal with that later. Um, alright. So I'm going to leave this here. So next time, we'll go back into the DLC. Uh, we will work with that. We'll see what's going on. And... Okay, it... Did this game only ever get one piece of DLC? Like, this old Hunters thing? That's weird. Because fucking, like, Dark Souls always gets, like, fucking 100 billion. Um, yeah. No we have for time of the year where the people play PvP with it. Okay, well... Alright, everybody. Well, uh... Yeah, we'll do that uh, on Sunday, I think it, it'll be. Unless we decide to do this on Saturday, because once again, I'll put up the, the vote on the at the start of the day. And yeah, as always, everybody, I am Nozix. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, share, share, to tell your friends. And if you're watching on the VOD, you can always uh, follow the link down there in the description. You can follow and you can follow on Twitch, and then you get a notification when we 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 go. So, yeah. I'm I'm really hungry to the point of it, it's actually starting to get annoying now. I'm sorry, I'm sorry if I'm not the most fucking coherent right now, I know. Anyway, as always, I'll see you in the next video. But once we've all become a trash mammal today, and I'll see you a round of